Okay, we're just gonna keep going. Today, we're gonna give people tattoos, and as of right now, we have no idea how to do that. It's a tiny little needle <laughs> that just moves back and forth a bunch. <laughs> okay! I don't know who these people are who are coming in to get a tattoo from us. I feel like that's a huge risk they're taking. Oh, I don't have ink. I was just gonna stab you without any ink. <laughs> what kind of waivers are we having these people sign? Today we are giving tattoos without training. Hey, I'm Hunter, uh, this is Cal, and this is our tattoo show. It's a magical bond. I mean, yeah. it's like cheesy as that sounds. It's very intimate. It's gonna be a nice time. Who designed the tattoos they'll be doing today? We did a few each and they picked. Oh, so the tattoos are already designed. Oh yeah, they're yeah. ready to go. All y'all gotta do is sit down. Sit down and, and tattoo. Mm -hmm. Easy. Yeah. yeah. Paint by numbers sort of thing. <laughs> I'm more worried about the volunteers. Hello. Hey, what's up? So I'm gonna be your tattoo artist today. Best case scenario, they look at it and say, it's perfect. And they show all their friends and they brag. Worst case scenario would be them going, oh, that's not exactly what I was expecting. Hi, Hi. how are you? Good, how are you? I'm Eugene. Perry. I think body art is so cool. And if I had my way, I would probably be like fully tatted. Hey man, Hi. Zach. Nice, nice to meet, to meet you. you. What's your name? Ryan. Thank you for being my canvas of today. Of course. I don't want to give someone a tattoo. If I do it wrong, it's going to hurt. If I do it right, it's gonna hurt. Oh boy, let's just look at what we have here. As I understand it, a tattoo gun is like a needle with with ink. How does it work though? Shit if I know. We've got uh, the tattoo and the goo and the gun and a razor. I guess I have to shave you. So right now, we're gonna be shaving the arm. You don't want to tattoo a hairy body. It could lead to a nasty infection. Never shaved someone I just met. Oh, well, I'm honored. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little obsessive as a person, so maybe that's not the best with our time limit. <laughs> so he's gonna be applying the stencil concoction, which basically just allows the stencil to stick onto the skin. We're gonna put some of this goo on you. It says stencil cream, but it really looks more like soap. Kind of has the consistency of, you know. <laughs> Hmm. Do I tattoo through the paper, or do I tat? Do I put it down and then just kind of? This is the part where it counts the most. You want to make sure your stencil's in the right placement. You want to check with everyone that it's okay. Is it like a temporary tattoo where I should dabble the other side too? I think so. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh no! It's bleeding. Ooh, is it okay that there's just a little bit that is missing? I'll just fill it in. Okay. Um, oh, that's adorable. You yeah. really, you made a great choice. Thanks. Oh, Do you have any tattoos? I have one tattoo. I have a smiley face on my butt. I'll show you my butt afterwards. It like, it would fit in great with your arm. <laughs> you start from wherever your dominant hand, wherever you're tattooing from, from that side, and then move forward. Oh, I hate it. I don't like being in charge of this. I don't want to hurt you. You couldn't hurt me. I could. I think when I know what I'm doing, I work well under pressure. When I don't know what I'm doing, where, well, I'm like, what? I don't understand it at all. I very quickly will start to be like, you've seen me in Without a Recipe. Turn on, we plant our hand. Go really slow and steady to give yourself a nice clean line, which is what you want. Okay, let's just fucking go for it, huh? Oh boy. <laughs> you did it. Oh man. I'm so freaked out. I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> Here we go. Mm -hmm. Just think of me as uh, Dr. Christina Yang. Okay. Now you tell me if, it's, if anything feels uncomfortable. This is why tattoos are crazy and I love tattoos. It's one of the few things you know will last longer than your own soul on this earthly plane. Like when you exit, your tattoo will stay. I feel comfortable. We've got connected over um, Shonda Rhimes' Grey's Anatomy. She just started, but she's on season five. Six. Six. Is Aunt Anne season 19 now? You got a long way to go. <laughs> I, 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 my goal is once Sandra O leaves, I'm done. Pick me, choose me, love me. <laughs> How can you lose Ellen Pompeo? I get to dip this like I'm a old timey Revolutionary War soldier and you're, you're my love that I'm writing letters to. I don't like disappointing people. It's a bad feeling. I'm okay at being bad. I'm bad all the time. But people don't expect much from me in the kitchen. 
People don't expect much from me when I'm doing physical activities. But here they go, Zach, you're creative, you're artsy, you're weird, you smoke weed. Okay, I forgot to refill with ink. I should probably do that. Yeah, I'm trying to think of what they might do wrong. If you don't stretch the skin, you need like a taut surface to be able to pull the line evenly. Otherwise, the, the skin will, will snag. Oh, hey, I felt gross. Oh, it got stuck in your skin. Oh, I hated that. Oh, you didn't react at all. Oh. I didn't feel it at all. <laughs> oh, that was gross. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh. Oh fuck! Oh, it snagged. It's like when a like a hangnail gets caught in a in a sweater. <laughs> oh, but the sweater was your skin. Do you remember giving your first tattoo? Oh, it was the worst. Destroyed my friend's leg, and I still think about it to this day. What's kind of the beginning of tattooing though is like having really forgiving friends that later on they're like, "Hey man, remember this?" And you're like, mm -hmm. "I'll give you a good one now." You know? Oh, I got a little anything. spot on the lip. My first mistake that I'm incredibly aware of. I mean, the rest of it's like, yeah, the line works not great, but that's because I'm physically shaking. It's hard to draw straight because this whole thing is shaking, shaking, shaking. shaking. Let's see if I can fix that. The tattoo machine is moving at a super high rate, so it's making tiny dots that end up becoming a line. Okay, now I have to do a circle. Am I gonna da 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 or da da da? So if you're doing this, these really quick motions uh, and trying to like feather it in, it's gonna look choppy. And now we know. <laughs> oh, I see, I see, it's like dotted. Oh, it's terrible. Yeah, if you're not doing one continuous line, it's gonna look pretty bad. It's a little jagged because I was probably just too nervous to commit to a line. <laughs> you do the first line and then you wipe and it's not there and you're just like overcome with stress and sweat and just like, <laughs> I think that's gonna be a fun thing to see. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> just like that, it's gone. It feels like it's wiping away. <laughs> <laughs> that am I not pressing hard enough? Yeah, I'm gonna go harder this time. Okay. I'll tell you if it's too much. Confidence is everything <laughs> in tattooing. You just have to commit, I think. You just have to like kind of go for it. Did that hurt more? No. Yeah. It felt like I like entered your skin. I mean you are. Right. Yeah. <laughs> now how come that one didn't make a line at all? Well, we're done with the first pass. I've been told I need to do it twice. Are you used <laughs> to second passes and tattoos? Do most tattoo artists talk to you or is it more kind of like, um, an Uber driver situation where you just don't know what the vibe is until you get in the car? That, it totally depends on the person. Okay, that's a thicky boy. Yeah. Thicky, thicky line line. Now we're cooking with gas. <laughs> Ahmad, do you think that Eugene should get a tattoo? Uh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> I, could, I could give him one, I'm doing a real good job. <laughs> what do you think of tattoos? I'm okay with other people, but then my son. Ah, that's a nice way of putting it. After I die, you can do <laughs> <laughs> Great, perfect. So it's more of a commemoration. Okay, great. And we're gonna call that a freaking tattoo. Yeah. It's really cute. And the teeth are a little... <laughs> right, my hands are not that of a surgeon. So you guys each train for at least two years before you tattoo the person. How would you have felt tattooing? I think I would have been overly confident. Being a part of it and being around it for two and a half years is what humbles you. It's always fun learning you're not good at things. Always. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so cute! Oh, I love it. Oh yeah, this is perfect. So, gentlemen, today I worked with my client to create a beautiful smile that's almost as beautiful as their smile. I sort of went with a rough line approach. <laughs> what do we think? Oh, wow. Yeah, no, I, I see the sketchiness thing that you were saying. I think what I would have done is I would have like maybe committed a little bit more. It looks like you went really fast. It's got a lot of like pizzazz to it. I kind of like it. It's definitely zazz. I would say I would have I would have gone in a little bit more right here. There's a lot of the stuff that's like reddish or kind of gray or you know around yeah. the bottom and stuff. That's just gonna fall out. Yeah. Fall out. Like it, it yeah, just won't be there. It won't exist. Yeah. Fall out That's why you is have to the phrase. That's yeah. what we call it, yeah. yeah. It'll we'll just yeah. fall out of this just, skin. There's just a tattoo on the floor? It falls yeah, out. Yeah. You don't feel the leg underneath the needle jabber. No. You know? Yeah. So it, sometimes it, I, it was like, I don't even know if I'm touching. There's a sweet spot that you can feel in your hand when you're in that like perfect groove. You can. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe not on your first tattoo. But <laughs> it's not that bad, honestly. I've honestly seen worse 
first tattoos from people who are trying, are to, trying to be a tattoo. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Honestly. Well, that's yeah. upsetting. Well. <laughs> Maestros. Just as the Shonda Rhimes television series Grey's Anatomy has been on air since 2005, uh, so too will this tattoo be on my lovely client Perry's leg. Beautiful. <laughs> Here, let's take a look. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. That's really good, Eugene. Oh, shocker. <laughs> <laughs> I certainly needed the second pass to, to cover up a lot of mistakes, but I'm really surprised. I am too, that looks awesome. Yeah, maybe one of the better first tattoos I've ever seen. It's a really hard design to make as yeah. well. If you're surprised, you clearly don't watch our videos. <laughs> yeah. Wow. No, yeah. That's pretty good. I mean, I see some mistakes. <laughs> Just me, I see a couple. Yeah. Go ahead and point them out. Yeah. Well, yeah, what? like on the bottom, right there, the second one up, it's a little, a little squashy for sure. It looks like a bug got in the web and the spider had to redo it. It's not a perfect circle in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> Judges. Today I present to you a flower that's adorable. Flowers are always changing. We wanted to capture that vibrancy. <laughs> what does that mean? Oh, oh look, at that guy. look at him. You know what I like the most about this so far? The circle doesn't connect at all. Yeah. And so it looks kind of like it's like on purpose for some reason. Was it's, it on purpose? It's the flowers moving. Yeah. It's the chaos of life. You're really feeling it. Where did yeah. you start on it? And where did you where do you think you remember ending? See, that's up to interpretation. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we jump around. Because <laughs> some of the stuff in the middle looks all right. Yeah, okay. it feels like you really tried on this part. Yeah, yeah. That's what we do here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what would you say your notes should be? What would you do differently next time? I don't think I had a consistent pressure and thickness, so I'm afraid that it's going to be like darker, lighter at different parts. I, I got to a point where I was like, I think if I try and fix this, I'll make it worse. Yeah. And also, there's some lighter lines on the other tattoo, on the tattoos around it and stuff. like. Honestly, will heal and match perfectly. Wait, okay, let's see this. Is it the same tattoo? Yeah. Yes. Okay, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, so um, to me, that looks a little copy and paste, whereas this has charm. Are <laughs> um, you telling me my tattoo's ugly? No, it's not ugly, it's just... Basic. 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 Yeah. You know, like, you've seen it, the been word, there, done that. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the word you're looking for. I feel like I've been freaking set up here. I'd like to see it <laughs> side by side with the other two, okay? All right, y'all. So we're going to go down the line and say, are you going to keep it, cover it, or fix it? <laughs> <laughs> um, I love this. <laughs> I'm genuinely saying this like from my heart that I love this design and I love how you tattooed it. I think that I would like to get it uh, added to. So fix it. Yeah. Yes. Refine it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's better than cover. Yeah. Yeah. I'll take it. Actually, you did a really good job. I'm definitely going to keep it. I might just get it like shaded so it matches my other tattoos. I but... agree. It's a nice way of She's rewording fix it. Yeah. Yeah. Embellish. Embellish. Zach. Yes. I'm going to keep it. Yeah. No changes, no changes. Wow. Wow. Matches oh, yeah, really? the rest okay. of the vibe it, of the... It does. Yes, I'm gonna keep it. Wow. I'm gonna keep it, Keith. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, sure. Thank you for watching the video. I'm the best tattoo artist. It's official and life is great. I think this was a perfect video and there's nothing more to say. <laughs> Comment below about what you want to see Zach tattoo around his ass smiley face and he will do it if it's the most upvoted comment. Oh, he wow. promises he will do it within this year, and maybe one of these guys will tattoo it. Yeah. Maybe they'll be subjected to see the booty. But in any case, it's all up to you, audience. Oh, did you show us the booty you never showed Ryan? Oh, yeah. Show us your butt. <laughs> show us your butt. <laughs> show us your butt. Does anyone here not okay? want to see my butt? Does anyone here not want to see my butt? It's just a slight butt cheek. It's like Kinda, the side. I've seen a lot of butts in this Okay. Show us your butt. Show us your butt. Yay! Yeah. But you're here, like we can have them hang out. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, thanks for watching. <laughs>So in the end, you were the Meredith Grey and I was the Christina Young. <laughs> and we successfully <laughs> achieved our, our surgical adventure together. This was just like brain surgery. This is just like brain surgery. Just as important. <laughs>